What is up you guys, it's Emma and today I thought we could do a Roxy update. Mwah. So it's been almost two years since I posted my Meet My Puppy video and I thought it was about time we did a little update on how Roxy's getting on. Should we get up and get ready and go downstairs? <laughs> you want some more? Again. Roxy is actually turning two in April. I cannot believe how fast time has gone since we picked her up. Um, but she's been so, so awesome. Oh. 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 <laughs> Roxy has actually had to move house quite a lot. The very first house she moved into uh, was the house we were living in two houses before this one. And while this house was being built, we were living with parents so then she stayed there with us so this is her third house she is settling in really well she loves it there's a nice big garden for her and it's just perfect ready Rexy putting together a shelf let's do this do the rest for me good girl no, but you, no. You're doing it the opposite way. You're doing it the opposite way. <laughs> I found that like as she's growing older, she's shedding more hair and she's actually getting a little bit of gray on her chin. Are you? Mm. Right there, right there. I've always heard of pugs having a lot of health issues with uh, their eyes and their breathing. Roxy has been very lucky. Um, so far there's been no issues. There was a point last year where we decided to put Roxy on a diet because she was looking a little chunky in places and it's what the vet recommended. Apparently with pugs it's very easy for them to put weight on so it's kind of key to keep on top of it and make sure that they're healthy, getting plenty of exercise. If they do put the weight on it's harder for them to lose it so we're trying to keep Roxy at a consistent weight right now. And she is so freaking fast. Roxy is very aware of my schedule with my broadcasting, uh, my vlogging, and all my music stuff that we've got going on. And uh, she's kind of um, really intelligent like that. She knows when I'm about to broadcast, she knows when I'm going out, she knows everything. I feel like you sense everything that we're about to do. Do you know we're even doing a vlog right now? Who's that on the screen? Is that you? Who's that? Like any pug, she is very clingy. <laughs> Especially when I'm trying to work here at my desk, she is constantly wanting to sit on my lap and be close, which is fine by me. She does have a tendency of falling asleep while she's sat up as well. those rolls, Michelin man. Although Roxy is turning two, I still, I still call her, I still refer to her as a puppy. Um, she is still really, really small for 
uh, her age. She was the runt of the litter, so maybe that's why she's smaller. We have had some discussions about getting Roxy a little friend, but nothing's set in stone yet. You don't even remember how cute you were, do you? Let's attack the pug star! Pew 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 pew! Oh no, the pug star has got me! Good dog puggy fridge. Look, oh, you're so pretty. Do you remember the day that you pooped at the top of these stairs, the day we moved in? Because I do. Oh, you stink. You smell so bad. I can play your belly like a washboard. <laughs> That's one thing with pugs, especially fawn pugs. They molt hair everywhere. I can't wear anything black anymore. <laughs> I know a lot of people would hate the idea of this, but Roxy does sleep on our bed every single night. She wouldn't have it any other way. We have the tiniest bed anyway. And although she looks small, she can stretch. This is my daily life. <laughs> I'm genuinely considering making an assault course for her in our garden, because she just runs and runs and runs. <laughs> Should we make a little puggy assault course in the garden? I'd build it and then you wouldn't go anywhere near it. So whenever I am working here at my desk and she can't sit on my lap, she usually sleeps either there, there, or on my feet. This is my impression of you. Can you see how many kisses we can get in a minute? Ready, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Roxy's favorite word. Birds. Some girls risk their lives in order to collect water for their chicks. Roxy's least favourite word. Bath. Put you in the bath. Oh, oh, I can't do it. I just saw your pupils dilate. Just to give you a visual of how much dog hair I have to deal with on a day-to-day -day basis. Look at this. I've just washed, I've just put these on. These have just come out of the washing machine. Lint rollers are my best friend. The only issue with Roxy being in this room when I'm trying to broadcast and stuff is that she's taking a liking to eating my yucca plant. Roxy, no! Don't eat it! I can see you looking at me. Sometimes I'll be working and then I'll just feel her presence in the room. What are you even doing? You ready? Steady? Go! Done. Good girl. You're a good girl. Shortly after that, I'm pretty certain she pooped on the stairs. In you. Mm. Thanks for watching, you guys. Hit like and subscribe. Make sure you keep voting for me in the iHeartRadio Music Awards. Thank you to everybody that's voted so far, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for another vlog. Bye.